Leon and Maria Benjamin are pastors of New Lies Harvest Church, and it's a beautiful church in Richmond, Virginia, and they have three wonderful children under our plan. They will get a larger tax refund to help them pay their bills. They'll receive a tax refund this year of $3,000. Leon and Maria, I would love you to discuss your middle-class tax cut a little bit with the millions of people watching right now on television. You do very well. We're very proud of you. And it is indeed a beautiful church. I got to see a very, very nice picture. We'll have to get there someday soon. Thank you. Come on in. Please, please. <laughs> <laughs> to God be the glory. Thank you, President Trump, you know, for inviting us here you know, on behalf of the Benjamin family and of course, Richmond, Virginia, we represent a cadre of many families across the nation. Uh, African-American families, urban communities, and families all across need this now. And it's time for a change. And it's time that we recognize that our president is making good on his promises. Thank you, Mr. President. God bless you, and we'll continue to keep praying for you and your team as you move forward and, and forge ahead with this new future in America. God bless you. He can be my minister anytime. <laughs> the Howard family lives in Tonino, Washington. Isaac owns an espresso machine service company. And Emily takes care of their four beautiful children. They're currently in the 15% bracket and pay $2,500 in taxes. Our plan will totally wipe out their tax bill, and they might even get a refund of substantially more than $700. I'd like to introduce them. Come on up. to speak for us today. <laughs> we are absolutely blessed to be here. So thank you, Mr. President. It's our joy to stand before you guys. And um, what this means to us as a family is that we will be able to pour out into our community, whatever that looks like, giving away to families that are in need or setting them up for success in any way that, that whatever God has planned for our family. I think that that is our goal, and we are blessed to have such an amazing president and what a good steward he is of our country. So thank you, Mr. President. Well, thank you all. It's uh, critically important for Congress to quickly pass these historic cat tax cuts, and that's going to take place uh, I think even before the media. I use the word media, do you notice? As opposed to fake news media, I don't say. Because <laughs> today is a very important day. We want everybody to be covered very accurately. So I'm excited to announce that if Congress sends me a bill before Christmas, the IRS, this is just out, this is breaking news, has just confirmed that Americans will see lower taxes and bigger paychecks beginning in February, just two short months from now. Okay? Just got that. We just got that. Fifty-five years ago this week, President John F. Kennedy, a Democrat, launched a historic effort to pass sweeping, top-to-bottom tax cuts. A half a century later, we're reminded that lowering taxes is neither a Republican or Democrat idea, but an American principle and an American idea. The goal of my administration is for every American to know the dignity of work, the pride of a paycheck, and the satisfaction of a job well done.